circuit number two is squat row and curtsies right and left. So squat row, coming into that squat stance, might be a little bit wider because you're going to come into that with a kettlebell. So about a 10, 15 or 20 pound kettlebell will be good. You could also do this with a dumbbell if it doesn't work out for you. So you're just gonna come down into a squat, row it up. Elbows are always higher than your wrist. You're coming up to your collarbones. Make sure your elbows come in line with your shoulders. So squat, row it up. Squat and row. Again, make sure your torso is upright, that you're not looking down at the floor, that your gaze is forward, your hips are forward. Squat and row. Exercise number one, 45 seconds. Exercise number two is curtsy right and left, 45 seconds. So here we come into our curtsy, you cross one leg behind the other. Knees are about at the same spot when you cross. I come into a little bit wider curtsy. If you wanna add a curl to your curtsy, you can do that for extra calorie burn, extra muscle movement. Makes it a little bit harder. If your knees bother you in curtsy, then you can just come into a narrow squat, side to side. All right, exercise one, exercise two, that's circuit number two. 45